Hi, I'm Mariana, the VFX chick. I'm here to talk about something really important, unionizing. There's been a lot of talk about it in the visual effects industry lately. Unfortunately, there's tons of misconceptions and rumors about it floating around, and I'd like to address some of them. Misconception number one. If I sign a rep card, my employer will find out and I'll get blacklisted. False. When you sign a rep card, it's like voting for the president. No one will ever know unless you tell them. Just the mere fact that you're actually scared of being blacklisted should tell you that there's something very wrong. We need to create some leverage. Rumor number two. A union would mean that all the VFX work will get outsourced. Mm, possibly, but not likely. Yes, we are a global industry, but if all the visual effects work could be done in places where there is low labor costs, all the work would get done there already. Now, this hasn't happened yet, and there's highly skilled workers all around the world, independent of unionization. Now, there's a small window of time where workers and facilities can turn this around to create a better future. The more workers we get to sign those rep cards, the better our chances will be. Rumor number three. It will create prohibited costs in an already broken industry. Very unlikely. Now, this will depend on what kind of contract each facility negotiates with the union. Nobody's gonna benefit from the companies going bankrupt. That is the complete opposite of what Etsy is trying to do. Rumor number four, I'm fine. I'm a staff with benefits. I don't need a union. Really? You really don't need a union? Rhythm and Hughes, Digital Domain, Sony Imageworks, DreamWorks Animation, Pixomondo, The Mill, Tippet. Vancouver versus Montreal versus Toronto. Isn't that proof enough that no one is fine? That at the end we are all freelancers? Five, the union hasn't really made their case. They need to convince me. Well, they're not gonna come knocking down your door. They're not gonna be throwing leaflets from a helicopter. We're sitting at our machines just hoping that someone comes and saves us. The only thing that can save us is us. There is tons of information out there. Please educate yourselves. Read Scott Squire's blog, read BFX Soldier, BFX Solidarity, go to bfxunion.org, email or tweet your questions to IATSE. Don't make a decision based on fear or lack of information. And there's one last thing I'd like to address. So studios need to do what studios need to do. Facilities need to do what facilities need to do. And now we, as visual effects professionals, need to do what we need to do, which is have a union that represents us. So please, while that render is going, sign your rep card. It's going to take you no time and you can do it online on bfxunion.org.